Hi there, students. Jaundiced. Jaundiced, an adjective. OK, I think we probably ought to look at jaundice to start with. Jaundice is um, a disease. It's when you go yellow or greenish. Um, it's normally because you have either a liver problem or some sort of a uh, problem with your with your blood. Um, I think it's to do with a, a chemical that's in your bloodstream and not being broken down. Um, I think it's quite common that babies suffer f from jaundice for because they don't have enough hepatic liver function. But jaundice we use in a different way. We use jaundice to mean showing negative feelings or ideas, to have a negative opinion of. So he has a very jaundiced view of life in middle class Britain. Yeah, he, he's not a fan of it. He doesn't like it. Um, jaundice, judging th everything as bad because of your past experience. So maybe I have quite a jaundiced view of life. Yeah, so you could look at something with a jaundiced eye. You're looking at it negatively. You don't like it. Um, let's see, jaundiced, prejudiced against something. Also, envious of it. I think envious is interesting. I think you 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 wish you could have it, but you can't, and therefore you're prejudiced against it. Um, let's see. So jaundice, discriminatory, pre, uh, prejudice against. So um, he has a jaundiced vision of the future. Yeah, it's hostile, it's bitter, it's suspicious, it's sceptical that it will be um, successful, resentful, something like that. So jaundice, it's having an unfairly negative opinion on things, normally because of something that's happened to you previously. OK, jaundice, we use this word to talk about the way people look at things. Yeah, so it's like a prejudiced or distorted judgment or uh, point of view of things. He had a very jaundiced viewpoint. Um, so um, somebody who, who goes to a restaurant and has, has a bad meal, um, from then on, maybe they have a jaundiced view of that restaurant, or maybe even a jaundiced view of all restaurants. So, jaundice, affected by the disease jaundice, yellow or yellowish, yellowing. Um, but we use it as an adjective, meaning to have a negative, hostile, prejudiced, biased opinion about something. You just don't like it, yeah? Um, you don't have even maybe good reasons why, or well, you do, but your reasoning is not very logical or fair. Um, I think a lot of people have a jaundiced view about learning English. I think school, learning English at school often makes kids very jaundiced about language learning in later life because, because they make it so boring and that's why they have a jaundiced view of it. So jaundiced, uh, jealous and resentful of something. OK, so what about the origin of jaundice? Um, I th well, obviously it comes from the disease jaundice. From, let's see, in Middle English there's a word jaunis, and I think this probably comes from jaune in French, yellow. Um, or even in Latin, galbinus, yellowish, galbus, yellow. And I think that's really where this jaundiced word or jaundiced word is coming from. OK, so let's see how formal jaundice. This sounds literary. I'm going to give it a 6.5 in um, 
formality. I think use this semi-formally or formally. It's a very literary and descriptive word. <clears throat> I think more informally, resentful, um, bitter about something, uh, not ha not not with a f not with not judging it fairly. Um, envious, envious jealousy that. Uh, this isn't the way the way it works for you um and let's well yes i've done the origin as well so jaundiced a feeling of bitterness resentment or jealousy for something um viewing something unfairly in an unfairly negative way so enough if you enjoyed the video give it a rating subscribe to my channel and i'll see you soon Bye for now, jaundiced.